This newsreel is being brought to you by How important is your health to you? If it is important, then you'll want to stop by our Serenity Shop in downtown Springfield. They're right across from the Robertson County Courthouse, and they have all kinds of products and services for both you and your pet. Organic supplements, great coffee, all natural pet food and pet treats, essential oils, and more. See a link to their Facebook page below this video. This is Jim Ball reporting in Springfield. The television series Nashville was in Robertson County today, specifically Springfield, to shoot some scenes for upcoming episodes. It seems that the uh, country music-based show has struck a chord with uh, viewers, no pun intended, uh, but uh, right off the gate from their pilot episode, uh, the show has just taken off. And uh, it's got the beautiful backdrop of uh, Nashville itself, and it looks like uh, the show's in for a run. Uh, that, of course, is uh, no less than Charles Esten, uh, one of the cast members of the show. As far as the young lady goes, we're not sure who she is. Uh, the Robertson County Courthouse in Springfield, with its beautiful architecture, has been the backdrop for many movies and TV. TV shows. Uh, the size and scope of the crew and equipment that the Nashville show brought along with them today uh, to me was a little reminiscent of when Johnny Cash and Chris Christopherson were in town uh, filming the last days of Frank and Jesse James. Of course, that was a full-length feature film, and they really took over the courthouse with uh, horses everywhere and gunfights. It was pretty spectacular. Uh, they filmed uh, a few scenes around the downtown area, of course, here at the Robertson County Courthouse, and then around the corner on Locust Street at the First Presbyterian Church. Uh, then it was down the hill to Memorial Boulevard to shoot some scenes inside Springfield Drugs. A Springfield Drugs has a beautiful classic 50s style diner. If you haven't eaten there already, you should stop on by for lunch. Uh, normally with these kinds of productions, you don't really get an opportunity to uh, chat with the crew very much, but uh, in this case, uh, some local businesses lucked out because the frigid temperatures had them running for cover wherever they could find heat. In fact, they set up refreshments for the crew inside the flooring center, which of course is right next door to Springfield Drugs. Well. There you have it, Robertson County. And you know, no matter how often the beautiful Robertson County area and its architecture is used as a backdrop for full-length feature films, or in this case, a television series, it's still a lot of fun to see it when it finally comes out. I know I will be looking forward to seeing these shots uh, when uh, the show airs them. We don't have their production schedule, so we don't know uh, when it's going to be aired, but uh, my guess it'll be probably within just a week or two. Are you a fan of the show? Who's your favorite cast member? Be sure to let us know in comments below. As you know, Smokey Barn works hard 24-7 to bring you the news and all things Robertson County. So the next time you happen to see breaking news, be sure to give us a call. Now, this has been Jim Ball reporting for Smokey Barn News. When you're going over the vast array of flooring options available today, why not consider a company that's been doing floors since the early 1900s? That's right, I'm talking about the Flooring Center. They're located at 505 Memorial Boulevard in Springfield, and the minute you walk in the door, you'll know things are different. One thing you'll notice right away, whether you're talking to an installer or you're talking to a salesman on the floor, everyone knows a lot about floors at the Flooring Center. So whether it's hardwood or tile, if you're looking for price, quality, and service, then you're looking for the Flooring Center, formerly the Furniture Center. For more great flooring ideas, see a link to their Facebook page below this video.